Hi, this is Kate here from Create with Kate. I just wanted to um, take some time out to show you this fabulous album my friend and colleague Anne has made um, using the uh, Prima Almanac collection. Um, it's a gorgeous black and salmon pink uh, colour collection and it's just fantastic as you'll see now in a minute if you haven't seen it already um, and before I start I just want to apologize for the state of my nail varnish I'm in the process of changing and uh, haven't got around to it yet <laughs> too busy crafting so um, I wish <laughs> but um, anyway so this is the front cover and uh, she has um, some gorgeous detail here if you see she's UT'd this lovely little bird um, stamp she's another LeBlanc stamp got done here um, and there's some fabulous trim. She's got uh, altered a Tim Holtz plaque with some paint um, on some scalloped designs and a pat, uh, hat pin and of course a Prima Bling. So, um, and then to open it, she's just done a magnetic closure and uh, it's a lovely little, <coughs> excuse me, sorry, um, tie here with some beading on it. Um, so it opens up and uh, the inside cover then she has some journaling note cards from the collection a um, little pocket created here and uh, some interest there and this side then this is another um, some more uh, journaling car note cards and stuff from the collection um, and some of the flowers it opens up it's an on, on the edge die of course um, and if you'll see here, there's another little pocket there with some more note cards. Um, another one here, and she's UT'd uh, one of the um, a die cut from one of the 12 by 12 papers and UT'd uh, the little clock. Um, and then this closes over again and goes into the next page. And here is some more journaling cards from the collection. And one there, and she's just bossy cut some flowers, and this day, some lovely, as you can see the paper is just gorgeous, it's real kind of, um, it's kind of a muted salmon colour, but some great detail on it, um, and she's stamped along here, little flower, and then this opens up again, and you get another little journaling card, more um, on the edge dies here, I think that's a postal plaque one, uh, of course it's a little tie there that closed it over which this opens back another die cut with more chipboard um that's tattered flowers just see die cut out um and more journaling cards here and she has precious memories stamped on the back and it's in behind the little bird cage which is gorgeous and this then folds down and you get more on this side uh, so she has fabulous in there and uh, I'll have to ask her how she did this it's just gorgeous oh do you know what that's from the paper and then it's just uh, embossed and god it's very effective it's lovely um, more here and then this opens up if you can follow what I'm doing so this was the other um, journaling cards here and there's a little antique reflections there I just love them I think they're gorgeous um, and this is another pocket here. I get confused now with all the. <laughs> all right, so she's another little card, journaling card for great for photos. Um, yeah, it does not pull up. Um, slide it back in. Oh, oh, put it up this way, and that opens out, of course. Oh, sorry, now I'm trying to slide it in one-handed. Um, and there's another uh, little pocket here, more tags, and the last little pocket here, more tags. So of course you can um, include your photographs, there's plenty of room for photographs and everything in it. So it's a gorgeous little album, I'll just kind of go back so you can see, and very simple to make, she's followed a tutorial on YouTube, which I'll put a link in down below. Um, and she's actually made two albums using this uh, style. So um, there's one with the Almanac, Prima Almanac, another one with the Prima Sun Kiss, which I'll show you in a few minutes. So that's um, this one, and it just falls down at that. And I'll just tuck these in. And this falls up. 
and these fold in clips there and that's that page and that's the front cover and it ties and just up close sorry now it's a bit fuzzy there so you get to see the detail on the back cover then Okay, so I'll leave that one aside. And the next one then is the Sunkiss one, which is an, um, I'll show you on another video. Okay, thanks. Bye.